Brazil coach Tite has defended the recent form of PSG's Neymar, arguing that the 26-year-old is still struggling to get back to full fitness following a foot injury. The 57-year-old believes that Neymar is outside his normal standards as a result of his injury. He is a gifted player, but is outside his normal standards, or he wouldn't be playing like this. He is only in the recovery stage. This is an evolution, if you look at the heat map of his last two games, it has increased considerably, maybe he will be at the top of his game in the next match. Tite then stated that people should not place all of the responsibility for Brazil's success on his shoulders as the Celica looked to secure qualification from Group E. The former Corinthians manager also defended Neymar's tears at the final whistle of their second group game against Costa Rica, stating that the Brazilians outpouring of emotion is not a symptom of imbalance, I want to say to the whole Brazilian nation, I cried on the phone to my wife after we beat Ecuador, just because I was happy, I am very careful about associating reasons with emotions. There are moments, of course, when you have to have a cool head and to keep a standard. We are aware of the emotions and the pressure. We have to be able to assess heart, head and reasoning. But emotion isn't always in sync with imbalance, not at all. Group E is finally poised going into this evening's final fixtures with Brazil, Switzerland and Serbia all battling it out for the top spots. Brazil only need a draw against Serbia this evening to secure passage into the next round, while a Serbia victory will see them qualify. Switzerland face Costa Rica in their last fixture of the group stages knowing a win will guarantee them qualification to the knockout round, but the Swiss will fail to progress should they lose to Costa Rica by more than two goals and Serbia draw with Brazil, Serbia going through on goal difference.